All right, we're driving into Sunset Heights development. This is the very ridge top here at Bonterre overlooking the beautiful Rodney Bay Marina and the Caribbean Sea. All right, so we're coming down the drive, which you see it's primarily a gravel driveway right now, which needs finishing, but it's motorable. And we're coming into the home. Let's just park right here. Pause the video till we get inside. Okay. Let's come up to the entrance. Double doors. Takes us inside. And as we enter, you see it's a very open plan. Large, spacious, and lots of natural light. And of course, the views which take you, take in uh, all of what we saw earlier and more. Let's get this one open. All right, so this, of course, is the highlight of the property the views and the outside space, living areas, um, all of the, the windows and doors which open out into the decks. Uh, this top floor actually has one, <clears throat> one bedroom which is the master bedroom, which we'll see in a while, which is to my left, right through that door. We came in through there, and down through these stairs is the lower level. All right, up ahead we have the kitchen, which is an open concept. You get high ceilings, space is allocated for fridge, stove, and a pantry right through this door. Okay, that's neat setup, very neat. Uh, uh, huge porcelain tiles uh, add to the spacious feel of the, of the space. So let's go through that bedroom we were talking about earlier. So you see, all, <clears throat> all of this room enjoys the view, just like most of the other bedrooms below. You've got the high ceilings again, built-in cupboards, and huge double vanity shower set up in here. Toilet. All right. So it's an empty canvas. As you can see, not much work is required to make this complete. It's structurally sound. Not a single, I've not seen any crack to speak of uh, structurally or any defects of that sort. Um, the house has been sitting for five years and it's never been lived in. Um, the developer who started the entire project um, basically, I suppose, uh, things didn't work out between them and the owners, so, and the, owner, the, the, the developer abandoned this project. So it's just been sitting there, and the owner just wants to get rid of it. He's motivated to sell. All right, so we're downstairs in a for a sort of a TV area downstairs. This is like a family room more or less because it's been, it's also been plumbed for a wet bar right here, which could be set up. Uh, TV could be put on the wall, sofas, etc. Through here is a bathroom. But let's go outside because, let's just get that open. Okay, so before we go out, to the left and right are identical sized bedrooms. So uh, not much smaller than the bedroom we saw upstairs. They are probably a little smaller, but um, it, the set setup is pretty much the same with the bathroom, as you can see. All right, we've got a water cistern right here, the access point. And another, another door which takes you out into, <clears throat> onto the pool deck. Yeah. All right, so it's pretty big on, on outdoor space, outdoor living space. The pool needs to be finished. It's filled now with water, but all the plumbing is there. It needs to be serviced and finished. But of course you see, this is what we have going on. A 4,000 square foot building on just over, just around a quarter acre lot of land, 
overlooking this stunning view. All right. So we'll walk around and let me show you the other bedroom, but it's pretty much the same, really. Um, it's a mirror image of the one we just saw before we stepped out onto the deck. Okay, so if you have any questions, guys, feel free to leave me uh, an email. Uh, drop us an email and or give us a call to find out more about this wonderful offer. All right, take care.